Yo guys, CPA Slayer here. Oh, my Xbox player, which is like Zafax. Um, today I'm gonna show you how to install mod tools, which is your first part of um, creating a zombie map playlist I'm making. So the first thing you wanna go and do is go to your C drive. It, um, and if you're on Steam, is like Steam. I can't remember where it is, but I got a disk, so you go Program 86, Activision, and then Call of Duty World at War, you wanna uh, go right click, send to desktop, create shortcut, so I'm create a shortcut here if you will. And so that's just for quick use and further tutorials. Uh, then you want mod these mod tools they should be in the description you want mod mod tools 1.1 1 .1, 1 1.2 1 1.2.1 1 1.3 1 1.4 sniper bolt uh nazi zombie tutorial v2 script placer uh but script placer doesn't go in so you first want to start off by opening up the mod tools this takes because there's so much in it this will take ages guys um, this is most probably the most time consuming consuming thing of it all mm -hmm. so I'm gonna pause it and come back when it's finally loaded okay guys so it's loaded and now you'll just see these bunch of different type of file things now you wanna go highlight them all and drag them into there now you're just gonna let this hit uh, go through and this will take a while too so I'll be back when that's done Okay, so when it's done extracting, it'll ask you, do you want to merge files? Press do this with current items and press yes. Then do this with current items, continue. Then you'll have an administrator pop, uh, screen pop up, which will ask you to say yeah. So you click yes. Then um, you just let it actually go into this one now. So it's extracted. It realized that it's an ad you need an administrator to run this. So I said yes, and then now it's actually putting the files on, so I'll be back once he's done that. <clears throat> okay, so that's done, that just took me about half hour, half an hour, just a bit over. Uh, it's all according to how fast your computer is. And so then the next one is Mod Tools 1.1. 1 .1. Um, you gotta do it this way or it won't work. So open up more tools 1.1, then open up more tools package 1.1, and then it, you should have map source raw zone and readme text. So this should take a couple of seconds. This is not as long as the other one. Um, do this to the next, and then don't press skip. Press copy and replace. Continue. Then it will pop up asking to say yes again. There we go. It just let that one go. Basically, um, the more tools was the first one ever, and then these one point one is just updates they've added to it. So then one point two. Um, open up one point two. Now this one might take a tiny bit. Well, like a ten minutes. So yeah, um, uh, that's what you're gonna do for until one point four, and I'll be back after that's done. I'm gonna go all, I'm gonna do all of them until one point four, then I'll be back. Um. So yeah. Okay. So one point two is done. Then you go one point two point one. Um, I'm just showing you this just in case. Um, I might not have explained it. So yeah, um, that's one point two point one done. So basically, you do more tools than one point one, one point two, one point two point one, one point three, and then one point four. So I'll be back after doing three. Uh, I'll, I'll I'm gonna do three then four, then I'll be back. Um, so okay, I've done three and I've done four. Now you want to go to Nazi Zombie Tutorial V2, and you're just gonna drag this in. 
basically this is the tutorial thing by Sniper Bolt. He's a legend because if it went for him, um, well, basically he's gonna help. He's, he'll help you with this mapping. So yeah, um, you're gonna have an error by your tutorial raw sounds FX characters zombie dog attack free. Uh, let me just merge these files so I can go back and uh, do this. Move and replace. Um, and rock, it says it can't find the site. I'm just press skip on it. Continue. Yes. So let's go in here. Um, this says it's corrupted. So that means it's. Um, that doesn't mean nothing. You can actually get that to fix. Wait, is that done now? Uh, yeah, that's done. You can actually fix that if you want, but um, you don't have to. Now, um, where, did, where is it to? Um, um, I'll just be back in a sec. I can't remember the next part. Right, okay, guys. So you want to go to your directory, then mod, then tutorial. Then you want to get the loadout, um, and you just want to put the loadout. No, um, you want to go to maps, then put the loadout in there, and um, is one more place you gotta put it. Um, what is it? Raw maps, and put it in there too. Move and replace. Continue. So yep. Um, now that's everything done. Now you can go back to your directory, and you can just open up script placer, and just drag that in there. You don't have to put it in there, but I just put it in there anyway, just for quick access. Um, so then you don't have to worry about the server script compiler error fix thing is all good um so f now what you want to do is go to activision like program 86 activision now when it says call of duty world at war you want to right click press properties then read only check it off and then press apply apply change and then just press ok continue yes now this will take as long as your computer so my, I'll be back after I've done that okay guys that took me about five minutes so now that's done uh, you go back into world at war and you wanna go to your bin and everything here which, which is application not the application exe just everything which has application you wanna click on properties compatibility oops and this will be like this on all of them you wanna click um, run programming compatibility mode 4 and windows xp server pack 3 run this program in an administrator apply ok now let me just check a couple down if that one's done then they're all done yep Right, so mine are all done for me because I've done it before. Um, and I I basically deleted everything off, put it back on just for you guys. So yeah. Um, now you wanna go to the launcher, and I'm just gonna pin it to me start but uh my start menu. No, okay, just pin it there and also pin it to my taskbar so there is um there's got there's normally a rocket on it but for some reason it's not showing it properties see look you'll have that little rocket which has light on it right okay so guys that's it you've um installed the mod cools at uh, course tools successfully if that's like that um i'm also going to pin that to me taskbar um and also for this one before 
Um, if you go script place of 1.3, everyone's like, oh, it don't work, it's got problems. Basically, it's got properties, compatibility, run server pack with Windows Server Pack 3, run as an admin, apply, and OK. Then an administrator little bot play will come up. Press yes to open your app. Now just give it a sec to open. There he is. And then it, oh, default NAT and this goes on me now make it for you guys I'm gonna call it you tube underscore tutorial YouTube tutorial and prototype is like the first maps and then um, Reese is obviously the Reese so I can have all the perks and last so press generate generate successful okay cross that off now that's it guys next one I'm gonna show you um also um quickly you wanna go open up launcher let it load up and press converter and it's just gonna convert all them files for you so um I'll be back uh, don't worry about these errors it's okay I'll be back when that's done <laughs> okay guys so mine's done it says the last one will be converting wasp flame third person lame table ten of nine <laughs> even though that's a bit impossible but still so that's done and uh, in the next tutorial I'm going to show you a bit about radiant so I'm uh, yeah so I'm out guys peace